So before this video starts, if you guys are new to the channel and you guys like my team content, I upload pretty much two my team videos every single day. Remember to subscribe. We are so close to 30,000 subscribers and we are trying to hit that goal by NBA 2K18, which is like the middle of September. So anyway, now let's get on to the video. What is going on guys, DBG here, in this video we are going to be playing a game against YBC, the best defender in NBA 2K17, my team. He plays normally a 3-2 trap zone, and it's extremely frustrating. Here is just some video highlights of him frustrating the hell out of a lot of YouTubers. 9 point lead, our first comfortable lead of the game. Literally comes with 20 seconds left. I gotta hand it to this guy. His defense is like really fucking frustrating. It makes you so mad. Come on! Done, bro. Done. I, I, bro. I'm out, bro. I, can, I can't play zones, bro. That's just off ball. I can't, bro. I'm out, dude. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I remembered why I refused to play this guy for the first while. Even more so than TJ. TJ is just good at the game. This guy is the most frustrating player to play against. So anyway, link to this channel will be in the description. Check it out. He is honestly the toughest and most frustrating player to play against in my team this year. Like I've been beaten by more by other players, but he's just really, really frustrating to play against. And also he told me he has a new defense, which is why I want to play him and see if I can still beat him like I did the last time. So anyway, now let's get on to the game. Okay, his team, it's not bad at all to be fair. It's not bad at all. Um, I'm gonna go with a bit of a different team than I originally planned on. See, he's gonna sit in a 2-3 zone, I know that. Fine, good shot, Peja. Look at that board, Look at that board. Go right at him, let's go, Nikola Jokic. All right, so I know he's gonna sit in a 2-3 zone the entire game because he did that the last game against me. A little bit of technical difficulties, we have to pull up that game and he's gonna nail this through Curry right here. Yep. Pass the ball, Peja, put it up, green light, let's go. Get back in. Oh, it's open for Curry. Damn, it's a great pass by him. Like he's honestly, he's one of the best players in the community. And I'm not even saying that lightly, like he's top three or four, I'd say, easily. Is he playing man to man? Is he actually playing man to man for the first time in his life? Good shot, green light Nikola Jokic. Wide open, in the corner, full white bar. Let's go, Real. All right, one point game. Let's see. We just can't let him get a couple of threes in a row. That's fine. I'll give him that. I'll give him a two rather than a three. He can't play any on ball. He can't play any on ball. Let's go, Westbrook. For three, green light. Let's go. All right, one point lead. Like, I don't... I can't remember the last time either of us got a stop like. That's a very bad shot. I'll, if that goes in, I'll give it to him. No point. Now we put it up. Green. Nearly green. He doesn't matter. He's hot. He's going to hit that. Let's go, Peja. Full white bar. Let's go, Peja. All right. Four point lead now. There we go, Ray Allen. Wow, that shot is low. Oh, we shouldn't have taken that shot. Like, we just strayed so far from our game plan right there. Our game plan is to slow everything down. We just took that stupid shot there with Ray Allen. That was, we deserve to be down going into the second quarter. Like, that was just a dumb shot. Not a chance. Okay, so we deserve to be down because we took a stupid shot there with Ray Allen from way too far out. It's good. Oh, he's blown, he's blown them. He's blown them. All right, so, like, dumb plays, giving up, like, 15 offensive rebounds in a half. But, like, we're still only down five points. Like, this half couldn't be going much worse than it is. And we're still only down five. So, got to take some positives where there's very few. Green light. Let's go. All right. I got to figure out how to beat a zone. It's one thing I haven't been able to do so far. Like, why do you wait, like, three seconds to jump you in? Like, he can literally just run right through the middle of my entire team at Westbrook. That shouldn't be happening. We'll pass. Let's go. Tie game. All right. This game is incredibly close. Like, I thought it was going to be 
a blowout either way because that's normally what happens when we play. One of us blows out the other. It's a good shot. It's good. Yep. That's probably the best release of my team. Wide open. Wide open the corner. That's a better pass. That's a better shot. Let's go. Try again. Okay. Pete Maravich wide open on the wing. Green light. Let's go. I think I might go post in and out jump shots. That seems to work well against them. Getting into the post and going into out. Should have been a steal though. He dribbled the ball through my body for about two seconds right there. That's a terrible shot. Oh my god, how did he come out with that rebound? And how did he get a wide open three point shot in that play? That is just me being screwed. Like there's no other way to describe that. He dribbled the ball right through J.R. Smith's body for two seconds. Everything that could have gone wrong in that play did go wrong. Bang. Let's go. Let's go, Pete Maravich. One point lead. That's way out of... Oh, my God. That's out of... Surely that should have been out of bounds. Oh, that's good, isn't it? Yep, that's... Okay, it's off. We got a one point lead at halftime. A little bit slower in the second quarter. A little bit more stops. And we've climbed up the better in that half anyway. Steal. Let's go into Porzingis' hands. I'm one. I'm one. Da. All right. Three point lead. Let's go, Peja. Put that up. Put white bar. Like, that should have went in. That should have went in. Okay. He passed up in a wide open layup, and he got three points out of it. Like, I don't understand how Peja can miss so many wide open threes with 99 open shot three and an easy release to green. It just doesn't make sense. Why step inside the three-point line, Westbrook? And how did you... Okay, he made it. He made it. Okay, I thought for a second he missed that. It's wide open. Hall of Fame dimer as well. Let's go. We got to just keep going inside out. Why I keep going away from that, I don't know. Wide open. Oh, damn. Like, the good old-fashioned square button not working. Wide open. Oh, my God. Why won't my square button work? Like, I'm literally passing a wide open... I'm not taking wide open shots now. Thank God I hit that shot. I missed... Passing two wide open shots of Peja just because my square button is not working properly. Okay, defense isn't set up. And Westbrook nails with three. All right, we got a four-point lead. This is our biggest lead in a while. This is the biggest lead either of us have had in a while. Dive on, dive on, dive on. It's good. That's always good. And now we're now... Like, we're down one. I'm not even giving that pass to Jokic because I know I won't even reach him. In the corner. He, was he not hot like five seconds ago? That's Hall of Fame Dimer as well. There we go. Let's go, Patrick Ewing. He's just not playing defense in a lot of areas of the court. He's literally just covering a three-point shot. Which is the main shot in this game, so it's probably a good defense to use, but... Like, you can't run five out against this defense. He's going to stop you 100% of the time if you're a five out. Let's go, Harden. Wide open. No, Harden. Really? That's probably... Like, that's a huge shot. That's a huge, huge shot. And they go and hit this one with J.R. Smith to take the lead. Harden, what are you doing? 98 open shot three. That was such a big shot right there. Okay, please, Kareem. This is a massive shot. Let's go, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Three-point lead, two minutes to go. There we go, Kareem. Let's go. All right. I know I'm really quiet in parts of this game, but this is intense. This is intense. I do not want to lose this game. More than anything else, I don't want to lose this game against him. He's already blown me out once this year. I do not want to lose this game. He's zoned up again. He's zoned up again, which leaves Harden wide open for three. Harden! That's a full white bar. That's another terrible shot you've missed. That's probably the biggest shot. That is, no, that is the biggest shot of the game. This goes in. That was the biggest shot of the game, James Harden. That was to put us four points up, and now we're only up two. Celebration cheese. Celebration cheese. Let's go, Pete Maravich. No, Pete Maravich. What? Oh, this is just 2K screwing me. This is just 2K screwing me. Ray Allen, get in. Stop, Peja, get in. Go, Ray Allen. Green light. What's the deal? No! That was the worst pass ever. We had it. We had it. Why did we turn the ball over? We had it. Oh my god, we got the steal.
We got the steel! And we fucking turned it over! Oh my god, like, really? And we lose it by four points. I've never, like, I missed two full white bars in his run at the end of the game. Oh, but to be fair, that game could have gone either way. I'm pissed. I'm so freaked at this game. All right, so he shot 63%. I shot 65%. He shot 23 free throws compared to my two. 23 free throws compared to two. He shot... 22 threes. I actually shot more threes than him. For the first time ever, I've played him in a game where I've shot more threes. But he was playing his own, so. I had 28 with Ray Allen. Ray Allen was terrible. He was 50% of the field. That was terrible. I had 14 with Westbrook, 11 with James Harden, 12, 10 with Ewing, 8 with Maravich, 7 with Kareem, 6 with Stiakovic, 6 with Jokic, 2 with Porzingis, none with Kemp, none with J.R. Smith, and Paul George. I should have played Paul George more, but he didn't play. I'm really, really pissed. His defense was unbelievable, which is the only reason he won that game, and he did score quite well, but I am just so annoyed because I'm, I, ah, oh, he's just the most frustrating player to play against, and I hate losing to him. So anyway, that's the video. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.